All right, it's Alex Wilson from Catch Des Moines joining us because uh, we we heard from Dave earlier today. Things are going to get interesting later in the week, but we got to tell everybody what is going on around here. Yes, yeah, so we have a few things that we can get in before some of that snow comes in. Yeah, the S word. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So we have the Iowa Beef Expo. Yes, it was actually in town um, this last weekend, but it's extending through Sunday. So plenty of chances to get out there and check it out. It's at the Iowa State Fairgrounds this year. So you can go and check out some sales and some demos going on and admission and parking is all free. So you can go ahead and go out there and see that. If you want to see that full schedule, you can go to iowabeefexpo.com for the full list of events and see what else is going on. That's a really big deal. It, it is, is uh, for the beef industry to be here and be here that long of a period of time because usually you hear about a week and that's the pretty much the extent of it. But this is extended beyond that. Yeah, because yeah. you had called me and you're like, hey, and I was like, <laughs> yeah, no, I actually, it is going on both weekends, yeah, surprisingly. You said, you said it was starting today, but, but exactly. Yep. So that is what's going on. And it really great people that are involved with that industry as well. Yes, yeah, absolutely. Perfect. All right, so what else is going on? Well, it is state tournament season. We're kind of getting into it's that. It's hard to believe. I yeah. know. So starting tomorrow, you can cheer on your favorite wrestler at the IHSAA State Wrestling Tournament. That's taking place at Wells Fargo Arena tomorrow through Saturday. About a thousand wrestlers going to be out there over that time frame. I know. So a lot of That's matches going yeah. on. Tournament uh, tickets start at twelve dollars. You can visit IAHSSA. Dot org for that tournament schedule. Yeah, that's again one of the bigger events the state has is the wrestling tournament because yes. we're known for it. Yep, and there's going to be uh, just over 240 schools represented too. So a lot of action going on. So if you see a lot of people in downtown, this is what they're in town for. There it is. So yeah, use extra time and uh, please cut them a break. You know, give them a little bit of slack because they might not know exactly where they're going downtown. Yes, help them out if you okay. see them. Okay, now uh, we also want to help out getting people to cheer around the Des Moines Buccaneers because they're back. Yes, they are. They're back at Buccaneers Arena Friday and Saturday night. So on Friday, they will be taking on the Waterloo Blackhawks, and it will be country night that night with some live music. And then they will face the Sioux Falls Stampede on Saturday, and that day is the Doxy Dash. Oh. A really fun one. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. I, that I is an awesome event. If, even if you're not into hockey, I think that's just fun to see. Oh, the Doxy Dash is, yes. is, a, is a classic. It's legendary around here. Yeah, yeah, fun one. So tickets for the Bucks start at just $10. Always really fun to be out the Madhouse on Hickman out there. <laughs> I'd love to see the little Dachshunds and their little feet <laughs> scurrying along. Oh, and yes. it's, they have heat races, they have a feature event. It's like a drag race, but for uh, wiener dogs. And it's so, so everyone really gets into it, too. That, that is, yeah. <laughs> Nobody goes in the lobby when the, no. uh, the wiener dogs are racing, so that is really cool. Yes. All right, speaking of really cool, how about cool enough to ooh, shiver a little Bit. So I think this one's going to be really fun, especially with the anticipated snow. Yes. It's Shiver on the River, and it's back at Captain Roy's this Saturday. So it includes a lot of really fun events, games, exhibitions like tug of war, turkey bowling, and <laughs> beer cooler curling. So just a few of the crazy antics that happen out there. You can spectate or participate. Um, both are free to do. Shiver on the River, 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. on Saturday out at Captain Royce. Again, that was just really fun because you hear beer cooler curling. I've never heard of that before, yeah. So. I mean, I envision what it's like as you have a cooler and go down, but. It's probably a pony keg is what I'm guessing the, the, with the rounded oh, edges on yep, it. I is, see I'm, that. I'm, I'm trying to, to, to picture this. The, the turkey bowling, and that's, that's a lot of fun in its own right. So yeah. Yeah, we saw turkey bowling on one of the commercials on Sunday. That was going on on one of the uh, grocery store commercials on Sunday. So now yes. you know what that is in case you didn't realize what that is. Exactly. But there's a lot of things going on and a lot of people from out of town that are here, maybe they're watching it right now getting set for activities you have a website that is phenomenal that you can really steer people in the right direction yes we do we have catch moines.com and lou because it is valentine's day we do have a valentine's day blog up there oh, you in do? case looking for some specials or activities going on today so you can head over again to our website catch and plan your date night if you uh <laughs> maybe didn't and still need to in other words guys uh <laughs> you, you, you probably like a lot of us and you forgot to do something go to catch and give you some ideas of what to Yep. Do later on, and then when your sweetheart says, Oh, that was so thoughtful, thank you. Thank, me. Okay. <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> thank thank you. you. All right, thank you for spending a little time with us. We'll see you tomorrow.